CatchMeGrappling.com. I'm back, and I'm bringing you something very special today. I'm bringing you Carl the Heat Parisian, one of the all-time greatest fighters in the welterweight class in the UFC. He just got finished with his metamorous bout with AJ Aga's arm. It was a 20-minute brawl. You guys should all really check it out. But for now, he's going to show you something brand new. It's Carl Parisian's Armenian necktie. Here it is. When I come to psych control, a lot of the most of the time when I pass into psych control, they don't feel threatened. I'll, I'll be here. They'll try to turn. I'll I'll give that space for the contender. Once they turn, I just keep them here, and they feel comfortable here because they can put their knee in here and all that stuff. So once I'm here, my arms here, they don't feel danger because I can't choke them from here. But once I lock this up, I'll just come close. Leg will go over. That's it. So, a lot of times with this knee, you can push it down this way. Once I'm here, they won't, a lot of times they'll turn, which is fine. Work here, turn towards me. Okay, I won't do this because they'll turn back. So I'll just keep here like this, like, you gotta bait it. Once this is here, my forearm on the neck, I'll lock, lead those over, I'll lock them through here, and squeeze. You gotta get the lock over there. Yeah. See this baseball choke, baseball grip. Yeah. You got the baseball grip. Exactly. I'll post up. You know, I'll just be like, ah. you know, he's pushing my leg away. I have it. Palm to palm. Boom. Over. Lock up. That's it. Now, one more thing. Try to push me over. Once I come here, yeah, now try to push me over back. I can still stop it. My head will stop the roll. Do it again. One more time, I won't push you. So we're here, we're over. I go, he tries to push me over. I'll stop. See, it stops. And I still have it, it's even deeper. Show the lock you're doing. It's a baseball. You like using the thumb? Yes. You don't like to do this, no thumb. You know, whatever works, this okay. is a little bit better because it has more of an angle. Okay. Here, not really here, I have this angle. Okay. Makes sense. Uh, three grip? No. It's just when I come here, it, it's, it's over, I lock up this way. I don't do this, this is easier. It's because longer, longer, this is easier. This you can't, this is easier. So once I'm here, I lock up here, even if I go here, boom. Yeah. I tapped out. The Ukrainian, 6'4", 240 pounds. Because and nothing happened, I was here. And he turns to me, Brian, and I'm like, and I'm like, geez, man, I mean, I can, I can do something from here. Yeah. And all I did, I brought it here, I locked it up, and he goes, and he goes, and I'm like, shit, fucking car. And I just, I'm like, I just did this. You know what I'm talking about, right? It's the best. It's a good move, man. I've had so many guys with this. Yeah, I, I definitely felt like it was gonna happen. Yeah. I can do this. Look, if my grip is short, I can do the Komodo grip. Is it like yeah. the Peruvian? Good, right? Good. Good. Yeah, this is this is the. Did you call this the car recently? Car recently? Oh, the Armenian necktie. Armenian necktie. Seriously. Thanks for watching Teach Me Grappling. I want to give a shout out to Carl Parisian for helping us out with this video. Thank you to everyone for supporting this channel. Please like and share this video and please take the time, take a moment to subscribe to this channel. It really helps me out. And remember, if you want to master it, get after it. Teach Me Grappling, stay tuned for more to come.